Hello, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use the text areas in Sesame. Text areas are used across the views for fields that can hold multiple lines of text. The size of these fields can change to reduce the need for scrolling and maximize the use of the display or monitor area. In this example, body, authors, and reference are text areas. The body field can be edited by clicking in the body field. The header of the field will turn green, indicating the field is editable. The information can be added into the field by typing. After entering the information and clicking on a separate field, it is shown that the field is resized as needed. If the information entered into the body field is larger than the available space, a scroll bar will appear on the right side of the field and the user can scroll down to access the information or add additional information. If information in the field is added or removed, the field size will adjust. For example, if some of the text is deleted, after clicking into another field, it is shown the field is minimized to the size of the text. The Authors and Reference fields below can also be edited by clicking in the field and either typing in the data like we did in the body field or copying and pasting information from another field. This can be done by selecting the data from another field, highlighting it, and selecting Edit from the menu bar and Copy. Click in the text field of the Authors field and select Edit from the menu bar and Paste. Since the information contained multiple lines of text, they are accessible by scrolling up or down in the field or even while editing in cases like this, it is simpler to click into another field, allowing the author field to resize. Standard shortcuts can also be used to cut, copy, and paste information. When an existing record is opened or the view refreshed, the text fields will be sized depending on the content within the preset minimum and maximum sizes for a given field. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and please refer to the help pages on the Sesame website for any further questions.